In this video, we will learn how to add social media meta tags on your WordPress website without a plugin. So what are social media meta tags? These are consist of two. First is open graph, which is essentially for LinkedIn, Facebook and a platform like them. And next is Twitter card, which is separate for the X or formerly called as Twitter. So what are these tags and why you actually need it as an SEO perspective? See, these meta tags are responsible for how your URL looks on such social media platforms. For example, here I have deleted all the meta tags from my our development block so this is the development block if i just copy this link and share on social media for example here if i compose a tweet here just pasting it down and if i post that so if i copy this link and post or compose a tweet on twitter now it's called x if i click on post and paste the link and just click on the post here let's see if it give us a look which people might click on it so it doesn't it just give a plain url and it doesn't provide a featured image and it doesn't provide the details of that particular url for example here if i pasted this here a url and it is shown as a featured image and there is a title to it so if you want your website's url to look pretty on social media handles just like this then you should install twitter cards and same goes for the open graph so open graph is essentially a default social media meta tags for platform like facebook linkedin and it is globally accepted as social media meta tags so on facebook if i share the same url here if i paste that so this window will start fetching meta details as you can see it has only fetched the logo of the website and there is a URL and there is a title but it doesn't have a featured image here so to make your URL look pretty on search for example if I post a URL of my website which is webby.com on these platforms you will see a drastic change so if I click on this and paste this here as you can see you will see a website you will see a play icon here and a featured image and all these metadata and same goes for the X if I compose a tweet and paste down here and if I click on post you will see a boxy look of my URL so there is a webby.com there is a featured image and there is a play icon so play icon is essentially a uh, optional but we will cover the basics of adding social media tags on wordpress without a plugin and now you must be wondering why without a plugin because i hate adding plugin for each functionality because not only cause a security issues but it will bloat your website and cause a big damage to your core web vitals and also bloat your website as you can see if you keep on installing such plugins for each and every functionality then your site will get bloated your site will add a uh, more files and your site will eat more bandwidth as well as storage so to combat this you can install a few pieces of code on your website to add such functionality without any plugin so if you want to go with the plugin then go with the rank math but if you want to go with the code and if you are comfortable adding a little piece of code on your website then keep watching this video in this video we are going to do it without any plugin so what i want you to do is go to the first link in the description box you will land here and there is a heading here how to add social media meta tags okay and there you need to copy all these code just copy this okay and go to your site here is my development website and here is going to the dashboard here towards the dashboard there is an appearance option from the left sidebar and go to the theme file editor and there is a theme header and theme photo there will be a new a new window will open there you can edit your theme files just from your wordpress dashboard and be assured you have selected your theme here just like here just go to here and select your theme if it's currently enabled on your website and there is a different set of files that are on your theme folder what you need to do is go to the theme header or header.php here if you click on the header.php there will be a head tag here okay and there will be a few meta tags already present there like a viewport or a title so what you need to do is just after the meta name just paste the code which i have provided on the website this one just paste that here so let me give you an overview of what this code says so there is a php function which will fetch the blog title info and there is a php function which will fetch the description and there is a php function that fetch your featured image so this is very basic social media meta tags if you want me to create another to add those play icon or something like that do ask in the comments box i will create a video for you here you will have this you are not done yet because you need to add it a few things out so first is you have a og type is article if you are og type is means open graph type is blog then you should add it as a blog and there is a site name which is you need to add your own site map like here like here you need to just select this particular code don't delete these commas or inverted commas or codes maybe digital just add in between them otherwise it will cause issues and there is a twitter creator so you need to add your x u 
handle or i will say the twitter handle in my case it's at webby digital just like this now i have good done the title description everything is up to the mark and now what you need to do is go to the update file so it will start updating it now if you're using a cache plugin like wp rocket or flying press then you need to delete those cache and reload and there you need to go to the url any url you want going to the view page source and there you will see all the meta tags are working correctly now how to see if it's working correctly just go to the og description and see if this is the description you want it right and there's an image this is the image you have as a featured image so if everything is working right then close that down and let's just test our website out so copy any link from your blog and there is a two tool which are available first is card validator so if we just type our url preview card so there is a log if everything is in green then perfect you are on the right way if any of the option in the red you have to resolve that so for the troubleshooting just follow this video again and recap this and follow the steps which i have mentioned so there is a batch invalidator you need to just paste the link here and click on debug so there you go results are this and you are reviewed one so there is no issues this is what you need now let's test that out on social media so for this go to your x account click on compose and let's see if this particular URL can fetch all the details we want yes it has fetched already as you can see there is a website name there is a title and there is a description and now if we click on the post here and just paste our URL and click on the post so there you go you will see the featured image here and there you will see the URL just like our blog okay and now going to the Facebook let's see here let's click on compose paste our URL here but we'll start fetching the details from website as you can see here there is a URL so that's how you can add social media meta tags on your website using this method without a plugin I suggest you to go along without a plugin if you want to use a plugin then go ahead and install rack math SEO and why am I recommending it because it solves 90% of your SEO related issues and you don't need to add a different plugins to your website like to add a schema like to add a social media meta tags like to add a redirection you don't need any other plugin just one plugin so you just need SEO plugin of rack math and there is a cache plugin of flying press that's all you need that will cover 100% of your SEO related plugins SEO related issues so that's about it so that's the purpose of the video and that's about it so if you have learned something from this do click the like button if you want to subscribe to our channel press that subscribe button if you have any questions in mind you have a comment box with you so see you in the next video till then bye bye